Give me my egg. <laughs> Give me my egg. Yes, my beauty blender. Give me my egg. Give me my egg. <laughs> my beauty blender back. <laughs> Good afternoon guys. It's about 12 and uh, Jameson's had a very long morning. He's kind of refused to sleep all morning, so that's why I'm carrying him in the wrap right now. Look at this guy. Poor guy. We're out eating right now. It is so hot. How many degrees is it, guys? 1,000. Anyway, so we're eating at Asian Barbecue right now. Another favorite restaurant of mine. I've been craving this. I have like a whole list of places I need to hit up when I go to Vegas, and this is one of them. Yeah. Preston, you ready to eat? Yes? Huh? Oh, you want to take a picture? Okay, say cheese. Yeah. Okay, you. <laughs> He's like, what about me? me? <laughs> then can say cheese. No. Okay, fine, you. He wants the candy. No. <laughs> You're always on camera, dude. No. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> hug him. Hug him. Turn him on. Say cheese. Say cheese. Oh, oh, oh. Now I'm on. Where are you? Think on me. Go to Panami. To Panami. Go. Did you Panami? Okay, go. Cheese. Present. Where's Jameson? Hi, little baby. Hi, little baby. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. By the way, Maddie. I vlog on YouTube and stuff. Maddie? Yeah. Okay, guys. This is Maddie, one of the owners of Toast Society. So I saw this place on Instagram and it's like totally cute. It's like, I gotta come here. What was your inspiration for this place? Uh, we really wanted to bring something like fun and unique to Las Vegas because I feel like there's nothing there, here. There's nothing here. Right? Um, and also, I found myself ordering avocado toast on like every menu that I could find in. Do you have avocado toast? Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, you know, I love the decor in here. What did you guys open? We opened seven weeks ago. Oh my god, it's yeah. so cute. I'm loving it. So I'm gonna go open tonight. We're gonna come back and visit. Perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. Hi. You wanna eat? Sit down. Yummy, Preston. Yum. Okay. Hi, mom. Mm. Yummy? You guys, it is literally so freaking hot today. I just cannot. Let me show you how many degrees it is. Let's see. Currently, 109 degrees. And that is the forecast for the rest of the week. I forgot how hot it is in Vegas in the middle of July. Let me give you guys a little update of the boys. So Preston is currently two years old he turned two last month on the 23rd he has been changing so fast you guys know that he doesn't really eat and you guys know that i've expressed to you my frustration of his eating problems he just does not like to eat and there were days where he would go three days without eating and he'll just eat nothing but goldfish and i feel like a bad mom because I'm feeding him goldfish you know what I mean but he's gotten a lot better ever since he turned two I'm not fighting him as much to get him to eat so that is a total bonus it can be very frustrating when your baby doesn't want to eat and then you just look like a bad mom because you're not feeding your child but what can you do when they actually don't want to eat so ever since he's turned two, he's gotten a lot better and he is eating a lot more things now. He still prefers lots of soupy stuff, so definitely noodles is his number one thing to eat. Anything kind of soupy and easy to eat, he'll be more than willing to eat it. But anything like sandwiches and things like that, he's not really into. So I try to make him congee, which is jiao, or soupy noodles. He really enjoys that and now he's even begin to eat rice so i'm really happy about that as far as jameson he is four months now and i'm considering starting him on solids so i think i'm going to start that here in the next couple days if if not um in the next week or so but i think i'm gonna start slow with avocado and peas Ho maybe hold off on the carrots because i know carrots is a little bit sweeter so i want to introduce him to more vegetables and then fruits later on but he can hold his head up pretty good now so the pediatrician did say that solids is fine so i'm excited about that the kids are down for a nap right now so i have a little bit of quiet time which is so nice because you know these kids be driving me crazy sometimes <laughs> I'll be in Vegas for the next, I want to say, two to three weeks and I am so happy because I love Vegas, you guys. I've been hitting up all my favorite places to eat. As you guys watch these vlogs every week, I will list the places down of where we've been eating. A lot of you guys have been asking me about my nursing and pumping situation with Jameson. I'm planning to do a whole like sit down in depth video about that i'll touch on it a little bit right now so the current situation with jameson is that i am exclusively nursing him i was pumping throughout my trip in asia and then since i've been back i've kind of stopped because i feel like Jameson doesn't really care for the bottle and he doesn't really care for the frozen milk which sucks because i don't know what we're gonna do because i plan on just um nursing for the next two more months so i'm gonna try to do or i'm not gonna try but i will do six months and i don't know if he's going to take my frozen milk after that i do have a bunch of frozen milk left over from the trip and i'm just not sure if he's going to take that and if he was more responsive to the frozen milk i would definitely pump more and work at it but he just doesn't seem to like it too much so i haven't really bothered to pump or anything like that um but yeah that's kind of our situation right now i'm just exclusively nursing and people ask me like do i prefer nursing or pumping and to be honest with you both ways has its benefits its pros and its cons right so for instance if you exclusively pump then i feel like your child um is more on a schedule so you know exactly how much 
the baby is eating like with Preston I knew that he was eating four to five ounces per feeding and about two to three hours and as he got older he would go longer around four months he would eat four to five ounces every three to four hours with Jameson I just feed on demand so whenever he cries I bust out the boob and I feed him and sometimes he eats for 15 minutes and sometimes he eats for five minutes it just really depends sometimes he just uses me as a pacifier and that's kind of what's been happening at night he uses me as a pacifier and it sucks because I have to be laying on my side the entire night and I have to switch him back and forth on my right and then on my left because my back hurts but then I feel more well rested in the morning because I'm not up at 3 o'clock in the morning for a feeding um, or I'm not up at 6 o'clock in the morning for another feeding or if I have to pump and those are the pros and cons of pumping and nursing of course with pumping you have a lot of extra breast milk and your body produces you know, x amount of milk for you to store and for you to feed the baby with nursing i don't have that residual milk although i can pump i would probably pump in the morning and at night if i were to pump again i am considering doing that once i get back home to colorado but it does get a little bit difficult for me to pump and nurse because i would have to watch preston and jameson while i pump and that gets a little bit too crazy it's easier for me to just nurse him and then watch preston instead of watching Preston because sometimes he likes me to play with him and I can't do that when I'm nursing and trying to watch Jameson at the same time. So definitely leave me any questions you guys have about nursing and pumping in the comments below. I will try to address that in my next upcoming video about my pumping and nursing routine. Like I mentioned, I'm considering pumping again because he is getting a little bit too attached to me. I feel like he is constantly under my armpit or on my boob or has to be koala style on me for him to be calm. I feel like that is a drawback of nursing because I read that babies that nurse they're very very clingy and attached to their mothers and I can see why Jameson is just very dependent on me and he is constantly on me and he has to feel me and breathe me at all times. <laughs> so that is one of the reasons why I'm considering pumping again because it's too much you know i just need to breathe sometimes so yeah that's kind of my update for right now and if i have anything else i'll um, talk to you guys in a bit bye i am hungry and guess where i'm at in and out good old in and out i've had it twice since i've been here this will probably be my third time having in and out that's okay that's okay you guys know what? Nursing just makes you so hungry. And for a while there, I was suppressing my hunger and eating healthy foods. But lately, I feel like Jameson has just been sucking the energy and life out of me. And so I've been craving lots of different foods and I eat like crazy, you guys. I will eat an entire meal every two hours. It's crazy. I just feel like he's just drinking so much milk and it drains all of that food and all the calories out of me you guys know it yesterday i was on youtube and i saw a whole bunch of videos on intermittent fasting i guess it's like the best new millennial diet or whatever and i was just curious hmm, what is intermittent fasting and are people really losing weight from it and I read about it and I guess you skip breakfast and so your first meal will be at like 11 a.m. so you'll have a lunch and you can eat anything you want you can eat anything you want between 11 to 6 and then you fast for 16 hours and I guess that's not so bad because you're sleeping the majority of the 16 hours anyway so you shouldn't be hungry but it's definitely not recommended for people who are pregnant and nursing because you do need the extra calories to nurse so i'm going to look into that as soon as i'm uh, as soon as i stop nursing but for right now we're doing some in and out okay you guys and especially since i'm in vegas and we don't have in and out back in colorado i'm definitely going to take advantage of that and eat it while i can because once i go home 
there won't be any more in and out and then we'll consider eating salads then but until then there is in and out by the way guys i wanted to mention that last week's vlog i put out the title was breastfeeding in public and i had a few comments from other moms talking about how self-conscious they are about breastfeeding in public and um i'll address that here you guys know what i have never been one to be comfortable about feeding in public either but i am not that type of person that is going to whip my boob out and be like free the nips you know normalize breastfeeding all that like that's not me because i'm so uncomfortable with that i just never thought that i would be that person that would breastfeed in public and i've gotten to the point where i feel comfortable with doing so um with a cover of course because number one jameson just gets so hungry and you know when infants are hungry they have no patience even adults have no patience so he is just screaming his head off until a boob is in his mouth and i don't have time to run to the car to feed him and i'm not gonna go to the bathroom and sit on the nasty toilet stall and feed my baby like i'm not gonna do it i have considered it okay guys i have considered it many many times i even go to the bathroom and i'm holding jameson and i'm like you know what i'm not gonna do this i'm not gonna sit here in this nasty ass stall and feed him like nobody eats there you know that's where we take a shit so i have just gotten to the point where i'm just like you know what whatever i don't know these people they probably don't even know or care that i'm doing it and i have a cover on and if anybody would like to say something to me i don't know what i would do honestly <laughs> there's one side of me that would be like yeah right try to say something crazy to me see what happens and the other side's like ah please don't say anything to me okay i gotta order hang on what can i help you with today can i get a hamburger a hamburger yes ma'am with okay um whole grilled onion whole grilled onion yes and okay. fries okay and that's it so i have a hamburger with whole grilled onions and a regular fry would you like a drink today no thank you all right will you be in the car yes all right eat it it'll be 455 feet at that bridge window thank you have a great day thank you anyway so one part of me is saying yes i will tell them off whoever wants to say something to me i dare you to do so and the other part is like oh my gosh please don't say anything to me because i do not like being confrontational luckily it hasn't happened to me yet nobody has ever said anything to me or looked at me funny i don't really put myself out there anyway oh my gosh there's a crazy sandstorm going on what the heck Gosh, my window up. There's like a tornado going on over there, you guys. Lord, it's coming our way. There's a crazy ass storm going on outside, you guys. Do you see this? What the heck is going on? It gets so windy in Vegas, you guys. It's crazy. Until the day somebody says something to me, then I'll have something to report to you guys. But so far, so good. No one has said anything. And even on the plane, I have breastfed next to this gentleman and he didn't really care. At least I don't think he cared. He didn't really look my way. But of course, I have a cover on. I think as long as you have a cover on, like no one should say anything to you and even if you don't have a cover on like people should just mind their own business it's not a big deal you know if people in europe and asia do it all the time they bust out the boob and they just feed freely nobody cares i think the u.s is the only country that makes such a big deal out of it and yeah okay those are my thoughts that's all yum you guys mm. love me some in and out president you want some fries Yum. 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 Job on money. Go job on money. Yeah. Go. Job on money. Yum. Wait, 
eating? Uh, eating burger? Okay. Fries? Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Ow. Yeah, kind of. Burger. Mm. Okay, fine. Jeez. Mm. Okay, guys. Let me show you how mm. I... Okay, here. Here. What do you want to say? <laughs> Who's this? Nay, I? Preston, huh? Go nay, I. Mama. Bungie, I. Right there. Who's that? Bungie, I. Good eye. Baby. Baby. Gongie. Baby. Right here. Nay. Good nay, I. Look, your mama now. Nay, I now. Baby. No, over here. Nay, now. Baby. Ba. 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 Do my. Ba. Oh, ba. Do my. Okay, guys, we're at home. This is how I generally eat my In-N-Out burgers. I eat it with just one bun because I don't like the other bun it's too much. Yum. <laughs> More? More, buddy. Here. Yum. You are so silly, Preston. More? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I eat it with just the one bun, whole grilled onion, and then I like my little peppers, and then gotta have my sparkling water because I try not to drink too much soda. Right? Yeah. Good night, guy, huh? You want some? Sure. You want some? Okay. Guy, huh? Okay. Then no. No. No, okay. Here. Mm. Okay, jeez. What moi? Tell mommy I know. Mm. No, why not? Share. Mm. 